Can you fall in love in first sight? Um, I think it's possible to have a, a strong connection to someone immediately. Um, I think love is something that needs to be developed based on, you know, common interests, based on, you know, um, how you continue con to connect over time. Yes, I think people can fall in love at first sight because if you if you see each other and you think that the love is right, then you can fall in love. Yes. What is love anyway? Love, oh, that's complicated. Love is a, a feeling of great affection towards someone that um, you feel connected to, that um, you is special, and that you want in your life. Love is when people care about each other, they do anything for the person. True acceptance of oneself. What is worth fighting for? What is worth dying for? Anything you value and that you hold dear to you, I think is worth um, fighting for. Um, you definitely need to you know, hold true to what you believe in. Um, and worth dying for, um, I think that's a little bit more difficult. I don't know if there's anything really worth, worth dying for. Um, although I do think I, I would probably die for my children if I needed to, so I would absolutely want them to continue on, um, to have a, a long life. So, I mean, I guess that is something, you know, something that you would hold value over yourself. I think love is worth fighting for because if you truly love someone, you'd do anything for them. And I don't think anything is worth dying for. Loving yourself. Who killed Roy Andrew? Um, who killed Romeo and Juliet? <sighs> Misconceptions, I think, killed Romeo and Juliet. Um, and, um, holding on to stereotypes, discrimination, I think those are the things that, um, killed Romeo and Juliet. Um, people not willing, um, to be open to the fact that, um, there's other things that connect people rather than bloodline. Um, uh, Juliet killed himself because of Love killed him. Why do we still care about Roman Juliet? What makes a word of literature timeless? I think the 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 concept, the theme of Romeo and Juliet go, goes across um, across the decades. It's not something that it was unique to that time period. I think that in many ways um, the the concept of people not accepting each other, um, of using um, superficial um, you know traits um, to discriminate, um, to keep people apart. Um, so I think it's something that can be just as present today. Um, as it was um, back when Romeo and Juliet um, is um, was made, that it's just something that um, that people can connect with and um, relate to their own life, um, regardless of the time period. That I still it. love Romeo and Juliet because it's a timeless story and has a story that we all hope and faith as close as baby was at some point. Shakespearean works are not boring, confusing, long and painful plays written more than 400 years ago. They're adventures relating to the extremities of human nature. Love, hate, jealousy, zealous ambition, fear, mistrust, deception, and murder. We owe much of our own language to his invention. He invented over 2,000 words for use in his plays which still remain in the Oxford English Dictionary.
the tragic love story of Romeo and Juliet. The main themes of Romeo and Juliet are fate, death, and love. William Shakespeare wanted these themes to be very meaningful and important to the play.